What's going on guys? Welcome to my channel. My name is Nicole Charnell. If you're new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button so you can see all my videos. And if you're an old subby, hey girl, how you doing? It's good to see you too. <laughs> Alright, so as you can see from the title of this video, we're going to talk about minimalism. Hmm, yeah. So, um, clutter makes me anxious and totally stresses me out. And if you would see like my room or my closet or my car, you would be like, Boo, no, you enjoy this. You like all this mess. <laughs> yeah. Because it's just everywhere. Clutter is everywhere in my life. Like, I'm like a hoarder for some reason. Like, it's just like in my jeans, literally. I don't know how to get out of it. So, minimalism. We're gonna do anyway. it. Minimalism has just really been on my mind. Um, towards the end of the year, uh, last year, well, in December, towards the end of December, for some reason, like it's been, it was coming across my feed a lot, on my, on Pinterest and everything like that. So I was seeing a lot of things about minimalism. Even when I got on YouTube, I would see a lot of things. And I've always kind of been intrigued about it because I just, I like the look when you go into someone's space and it's just clear of mess like all this extra there's no extra stuff everything has a place everything's like neat and clean and in its spot like I love that it's like like when you go into a model home or something like that you know someone you can tell someone doesn't live there but the first thing you think to yourself is mm, I want my space to look like that because there's no clutter this is what I need my life to be like I want to come home and look at my space and be like inspired because there's no clutter <laughs> Like, can we, can I do this? Yes, I just, I really want to do it. I really, really, really want to do it. So I'm trying, I'm starting, I'm pushing forward. So the first thing I'm doing is minim minimizing my clothes. I'm trying so hard to minimize my clothes. So I went through my clothes once already and I donated clothes to um, Purple Heart. Yeah, Purple Heart when they come and like pick up the clothes and stuff. So I did a donation of my clothes and my kids' clothes. So now with me, it's been kind of hard so I went through my whole closet <laughs> and I removed everything that I didn't love and my closet is still full <laughs> it's just it's so much more full than I want it to be as my minimalist personality so I don't want you know I don't want to be counting my items but I do want to have a theme to my stuff like to my clothes but like, black is like almost my favorite color to wear pretty much like I love wearing black and like a lot of my stuff my a lot of my clothes are black like so obviously that's gonna be one of my colors so I need like two more other colors and I need to just get rid of all the other stuff but it's just like so hard because like I like things anyway I'm struggling so my first one <laughs> run through I just took out everything that I didn't love and then I knew I could get rid of so right now I have what I have left are things that I feel like I love and that I can't get rid of so the next thing I'm going to do is go through and take out anything that is not going to be within my color scheme or my clothing scheme for or clothing theme I go in my closet like sometimes it's just so hard to pick out what I want to wear and I don't want it to be like that I just want to be like okay I want to wear this and just just go with that because everything is the same color everything is the same theme everything has the same glow and that will be the easiest for my life I feel like because I just have I have so much to do already and I need everything to not be a mess and everywhere and not stress me out when I have to go pick out clothes like so that's pretty much it that's like my step one of being a minimalist that's the first thing I have done so far and I'm gonna continue to do it as well um, my goal is just to not have any clutter and to not have stuff that I don't touch for a year like a year I literally have stuff that I just don't touch and I have it for some odd reason in my brain I'm thinking like oh I might need that no boo you don't need that you're never touching it why do you need it that's why minimalist journey is happening <laughs> if you have any tips or tricks for being a minimalist or trying to become a minimalist make sure you leave them down below in the comment box I need all the help I can get for real like I literally need someone to come to my house and throw away my crap we're gonna get it together though thanks for watching this video make sure you give this video a big thumbs up like comment and subscribe to my channel if you're not already subscribed also hit that bell so you can get notified every time I make a video and I'll see you guys hopefully in my next minimalist video and if you like these Make sure you share them, girl. Share them with a friend. See you guys in my next one. Bye.